What is the most, Evan Moore, what is the most shocking thing you've ever discovered in all of your research? Well, I'm going to tell you that right now. I spent years putting together a history of the world only to find that when I read the Jewish Haggadoth and I, and, I, and I found that the angel of death visits every 138 years, it clicked for me. Angel of death is just a frame of reference. They're talking about the phoenix. So I go back and I look through all my stuff. I already had notes on the phoenix, but I never attached it to any one single event except the event that many ancient records attach it to, which was the Great Flood. So, I have this huge file of all these different disasters and cataclysms, and common denominator was that the sun went dark for hours. The moon turned red, great earthquakes happened, flooding, rocks fell out the sky, and uh, civilization had to start over, and sometimes civilizations were now missing their people. So I was like, you know, I put all this together, but when I heard that 138 years that the angel of death appears, I went back and looking through them, and the greatest shock, the first shock I had was that they were 138 years apart. Now everybody can see it. I've never kept it secret. All my charts, all my timelines, I have I sell them on Gumroad. They're always in the links in the in the description box and comments. Right here. Oh, on my shirt, right here. Every little box you see right there is 138 years. All these red red deals, every single one of those is a phoenix event nemesis cataclysm moon appears here's phoenix huge pole shifts all kinds of things happening great flood vapor canopy vapor canopy collapses moving through history the old bronze age saw so many phoenix episodes here's the exact dates so we go into detail on this chart this chart is available on gumroad with a bunch of other color charts i just decided to make a t-shirt out of this one all the way to 2040, all the way over here. Now, shocked me when I put all this together and found out they're all 138 years apart. This is what the Haggadoth was talking about, the angel of death appearing every 138 years. Yeah, I was shocked. But I was even further shocked years later after I had read what the measurements of the Great Pyramid's rectilinear dimensions were in the research of Sir Flinders Petrie. So when I took Sir Flinders Petrie's scientific measurements that were done to one thousandth of an inch, which are scientifically accepted today and by Egyptologists accepted, I put them on a piece of paper and I wrote out all of them out and I kept finding Phoenix numbers. I told you, I know them by heart. 138, 276, 414, 552, uh, 690, 1242, 1518, 1656. <clears throat> 2760, it's just crazy. Uh, the 3036, it just goes up all the way up. And all these measurements throughout the Great Pyramid were commissary. That's the second astonishing thing. The Phoenix, the Phoenix timeline is encoded everywhere in the Great Pyramid. Yeah, that's why I, I, I release my videos. Because my videos have information on the Great Pyramid. No one has. No one's ever put this material out. That's why my videos are packed full of chronometrical charts and architectural diagrams showing all this stuff. I can't just say it. I have to show it. So those are the two things that, that shocked me the most. The two things that really shocked me the most.